your girl Earl from Embrace and Reborn. And I'm here feeding little Mr. Jonathan. He's still here with his little lovey giraffe. And we're going to get him dressed for being Thursday. Even though y'all have seen the outfit that I had posted pictures of him when I was at Miss Deborah. However, that's the only outfit that we have with the monkeys on it. And I wanted to participate in theme Thursday with him. And this is besides newborn, low Gerber outfit. And it's a three piece set. But for some reason, as always, I lost one of the pieces. And I don't know where the little hat is at to the thing. I can't keep up with these kids' clothes to save my life. But I promise y'all, before 4th of July, I am going to get three, three draw little, um, which is those stackable things with the little rubber me type little draw band that everybody uses. And each, the boy's going to have maybe one or two draws because that's all they need because they don't have that many clothes and the rest of the clothes go for the girls because the girls always seem to have more clothes than the boys and like i said i'm just getting into these boys so i'm not I, and especially with him he don't hardly have any clothes and this bottle that I'm using for him is the Born Free bottle. I don't know it's not glass. It looks like glass, but it is a hard plastic. It's Born Free, and it has the little ending teachers on the side, which makes it easier for you to hold on to. Let me make sure this is in frame. Oops, yeah, right here. You can see the indentations on the sides where you put your fingers while you feed the baby. And I purchased this bottle, and even though it has the long nipple, the silicone nipple, and it came already sealed with the milk, I always push it down to do the feeding videos. But I bought this bottle off of eBay with the milk is already in it. And for those who don't want to make their bottles, they can always go on eBay and put in um, Reborn... Um, bottles and they got all kinds the um and actually that's what i used to do all before so that way you see because i don't want a bunch of the same kind of bottles so i never would buy the packs of bottles i would just go online on ebay and buy one of this one one of that one you know already made save me the trouble but i mean i do know how to make the bottles now but it was just easy and some of them on eBay, you can buy it with the um, it comes as sets with the bottles with the matching pacifier. I've gotten those before as well, like the Tommy Tippies. Um, I got the lavender one with the lavender pacifier, and I believe I gave that set to my mom because lavender is her favorite color, as well as Miss Dawn. And, um, and speaking of Miss Dawn, Miss Dawn, I am getting worried because I haven't seen you posted a video. I haven't, um, you did comment it not too long ago on one of my videos. And it did my heart did to actually see you, you posted something. But I haven't seen you made any videos. And prayers go out to you. And, um, I know you were dealing with some things with your mom and everything. But I'm getting kind of worried. Anybody out there who has Miss Dawn, and that's Dawn World of Babies, if y'all have her email address, phone number, can you please tell her that um, me and Miss Bully was is worried about her, and can she contact both of us and let us know she's doing okay? I can be emailed at embracing rebounds at yahoo.com e m b r a c e n r e b o n 
I always say B-O-N. B-O-R-N-S. Rebonds with the S on the end. Embracing Rebonds. And um, just let me know that you're doing okay. And this little neck roll that he's on actually came with this blanket that says um, BB Adventure. This it came it came together from Ross, and it has a little puppy dog ear. And the set he taken off was a Gerber BB set, and the set he putting on is a Gerber, with the exception of the onesie. The onesie is a little me. It's um three month onesie. Which I don't know. I thought I had. I thought it was a newborn, but it seems to fit him. Let me take this off for a second until I finish getting him dressed. I'm gonna tell you, this little soft here. I gotta get used to this little flyaway here. <laughs> oh Lord! I went to the um my fit doctor this morning. They did some x-rays, but this pit bull keep running across my foot and jumping all her body weight on my feet all the time. And y'all saw the previous video with me singing her to sleep. And I don't think, she, you know, see, I got all these little teacup size and toy size dogs. So she thinks she is a toy and teacup, and really she will knock my dogs out the way. Which the only one I let be out with her is Copper the boy, because he, he's the biggest, so I let him be out with her, and he can handle his own as far as she's concerned. And, um... So... But... She's expecting now. We bred her. She's a blue and white pit, and we bred, bred her to a red nose pit, which was, um, I think, if I'm not mistaken, I want to think he was, um, he's a red and white. But when I tell you, she acts like a big BB, and she's even worse since she got pregnant. Oh, God. As soon as she comes, if she go outside, before she even go back to her little area, she's going to jump up on me. If I'm sitting in that recliner, she tries to climb up in the recliner on top of me. I actually got pictures of her actually sitting up in my lap like she's a teacup. And she really, really thinks she's a small dog like the rest. Well, when I first tried to do this video, I actually had put her outside. Then she started barking all across the video because we don't want nobody to walk past the yard. So I brought her in the house. And right now, her and Copper is at my feet. Each one on each side, stretch out on the floor. Because ain't none of them can leave my side. Because one don't want the other one to get no more play, th play than the other one. If you sing a little song for one... You got to stop singing a song for the other one. It's a mess. And this little outfit has the um, little built-in hand mitts. Which I like. And like I said, this is a Gerber baby outfit. And it's newborn. Size newborn. And even though this is a newborn, he still got some slack on him. But when <laughs> him and Deborah first saw this outfit, we like, we don't know if he need premium or what, because... He's so short, you know. And little, hold on, I'm gonna pick him up a second. Let me brush this hair down, spray it down a little bit. I just go, really, I ain't even gonna brush him. I just go pat it down so Get the flyaways. There you go. Where's your look? I had a singing little monkey. But I don't know what happened to that. But do y'all remember this little thing here? The little Manchichi? My sister had one when she was little. Uh, we don't know what happened to hers. The one where you could suck your little thumb. So I went on eBay 
and find this little one here. But y'all, and he got the little bell on it, even though he got a, they got the girl and the boy one. It's a girl one. But you remember the little song? My Chi Chi, my Chi Chi. Oh, so cute. He's hot to leave, but you're timing him out and you really see. I, I just love that little song. But when my sister said, when she went over to Japan, those my Chi Chi's are so expensive over there and it's really big over there. But also, we have his little. I'm doing Fan Thursday and Disney Monday all the one. <laughs> so we had the little Disney um rattle. This little baby Disney rattle. So with that being said, Jonathan got all his toy. Share the love. Wait, no, you don't need this little puppy here because you're on the barbie. And, oh, wait a minute. Let me show before I put, load you up with the toys. Let me show his little outfit. See the little monkey on the uh, front of his house? outfit? They say, thanks having you on for having fan Thursday. <laughs> I love these little theme days. I met a, a young lady on Instagram and I was telling her about it. And she asked, how do you find out about the theme days? And I told her, and for those who are new to YouTube... Go to having you on channel, and on Sunday she always um let you know what theme is coming out for the following week for Thursday. And I thought this was a cute little theme um thing with the monkeys. And I also have a little girl set, and but I don't want to put two videos out on one day, so I'm gonna put this one out today, and then I'll put the girl one out tomorrow. But anyway, just wanted to bring this, uh, bring him on, show y'all him in his little monkey outfit, and just chat a little bit. Wanted to do a feeding with him, tell y'all about where you can get the bottles. Oh yeah, and the pants that I put him on is light blue and has the little chocolate stars, lasket and wigs. It's a little fitted down um, pants. The shirt is a side snap, and it's pot light blue as well with the little chocolate monkey on the front. The chocolate monkey with bead trimming with the built-in hand mitts on the sleeve. And we got little Mr. here just part on the side, brush flat down on both, all the way around. And he's here holding his little manchichi and his little um, rattle. Um, Disney um, Mickey Mouse, which is also light blue, and it looks like his body is looks like it's all in a little baby sleeper, a little fur light blue sleeper, and anyway, and then it's a little rattle inside. See? So anyway, that's his rattle. He got his little. He's holding his little sister, mine Chi Chi um, little monkey. And I had, uh, I do not do, I, I had, I still have, I just don't know where it's at. It's a monkey music box where you pull a string and it plays music. And, and I was looking forward to using that with this video so it could have been playing a little nursery song in the background as I do the change of video. However, as always, when trying to do these videos, I can't, can't place my hand on nothing. And Hopefully by the time I do the girl one, I can put my hand on it. If not, they will, both will be shaming this one. Chi Chi doing the... Oh no, hers, her, she had the monkey blanket with the monkey headrest. And it comes with the little uh, monkey lovey. So we don't need the bar of this little monkey. That's right. So anyway, y'all stay tuned for that video on tomorrow. But this is theme Thursday with little Mr. Jonathan Earl. And for those who don't know, this is the baby... That um, hold on one second. This is the baby that I um did inside my um reborning class, and let me turn his face so he can look at his own aunt, uncle at Last the Memories Reborn Nursery, and he is the um oh Frankie kid from. From Bounty for Baby, and I reborn him myself. My instructor was Miss Mrs. Deborah C. Jettick, which you can find her on Facebook. 
Oh, you can um, Google her um, nursery, which is Lasting Memories Reborn Nursery. She does do custom babies as well. If anybody's interested in getting the um, custom baby done, you can look at baby she's done and adopted out. She also do payment plans where you can pay on it, you know, lay away. But anyway, I think I'll let y'all know about that as well. And um, I just hope everybody is having a blessed day. All I did today was go to the, like I said, I went to the foot doctor earlier. I have to, I went, and when I left them, we went out to have lunch, me and my husband. And then we went and have um, my impressions of my foot done because I have to use um, special orthotics in my shoes right now because I have a lot of inflammation in my feet which is causing a lot of um, pressure and pain around the toes and in the ball and joint. And when I tell you, at 47, I'll be 48 in October, <laughs> every body part of mine got a yawn specialty doctor, and I'm not lying. Literally from head, seeing a neurologist, to the foot, seeing a podiatrist. <coughs> so with that being said, Mom always say you never put no cheap shoes on your feet. Because your feet is the one thing that carry you through life. So if you're doing the type of job like I did, nursing as well as here. I And I just don't understand how I got all these problems with my feet now. Because most of the shoes that I worked in were all over $100. When I tell you, I probably got 20 pairs of dance clothes. Four pairs of the Allegra's. I don't know how many. I know for a fact I got over a pair of dozen um, Brooks. Those um, Brooks, or Brooks, I think how you pronounce it. Tennis shoes. Merrill's. Everything. Birkenstocks. Anything that they came out and they say it's good for your feet. I purchased it. And I swear these feet of mine give me a time. Since I had that foot surgery. And with these screws in it, it can flare up like you won't believe. If I go walk on the stone floor, so anybody tell y'all they see me on that little wheelchair cart going through Sam's, trust and believe I be right there. And I tell them y'all see me came out of handicap parking. Even though I may not look handicapped, but I have a lot of issues. And, I, and my foot is one of them. Oh, this foot gives me a bit. Ever since... I spent that last day with Miss Deborah and shopping in that in that um so I I have a video talking about my feet. I still even though the video is late and Easter and over because I talk about Easter as well on that video. I'm gonna post that video today as well. But my feet have been inflamed and swollen so ever since I was in Alabama, literally. And with the dog running across it, I thought that maybe I had fractured it again because it already been fractured. Was it two or three times I've had this same foot in the boot? But um, thank God it wasn't fractured. They did x rays, it, it wasn't fractured this time. We have a whole another set of issues going on. But hope, as usual, I always push through. Thanks for all the prayers and everything. Mom is doing better. After that first dose of Tamiflu, I'm telling you, it, it made a whole world of a difference with her. Um, by the time we got to, to sh the second dose, and she's been coming around pretty good. And we got her on one end of the house, dad staying on the other end of the house so that he don't get sick because, you know, he got... Um, respiratory issues as well and the nurse just released him so we don't want him having a relapse and i'm constantly spraying lysol throughout the house and wiping up and sleeping and everything else so anyway we're gonna bring this video to an end i hope everybody is having a blessed day Thanks for all of my new subscribers. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Feel free to um, comment down below. 
anybody that's new to my channel if you subscribe to my channel I usually try to check that part daily and usually I go right back and subscribe to your channel as well if there's anybody that slipped through the cracks and I, I didn't dis subscribe to your channel please make a notation down <laughs> below so that I can go back and subscribe because I try to be pretty good with that but anyway we're going to bring this video to an end you know if I go too long, long and rambling on mom and dad do a walk through and before they stir the dogs up but as soon as she just came to adjust the temperature Jules and pop up and we don't need her starting with her offer so with that being said while they all nice and quiet I gotta take advantage of this and I gotta come to the conclusion is so usually I put her in her cage when I try to do a video and this dog do not especially with those silicone babies she definitely don't want me putting my hand. That's why I haven't really do too many videos with them lately because every time I put my hands on those silicone dolls, I don't know what it is about them silicone dolls, but it stirred us pit bull up like you wouldn't believe. But today I decided, well, let me let them just stay loose and sit by me so that she knows she's still special to me and the dolls ain't taking over her. Um, Because she's very protective of me that um and that she don't want to share me with my, with the doll babies that's the thing so i said well we'll try this today and see how this work well i tell you the truth having her loose seem to be the quietest video everybody see him calm and i think my yorkies are running themselves wild in the yard today back there sleeping so even they ain't mixing up and like i said jules right by me cop on one side of me and both of them just laying down sleeping so this might be the new way for me to do my videos without a bunch of um noise and interruption in the background but once again it's your girl earl from embracing reborns y'all have a blessed day and i would like to say thanks for watching